Hi everyone, this is Kelly from Moon Pie Tarot. This is uh, your general love reading for Aquarius for February 2017. If you would like to get a personal reading from me, please contact me on the Instant Go app, or you can go to my website, moonpietarot.com, request a reading there. Those readings take up to about seven days. So the deck that I'm using, Aquarius, is the Crystal Visions Tarot deck. And uh, this reading is, I hope I said 2018, February 2018, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Some of the messages may or may not resonate, so if they don't, you can always request a personal reading from me if you have a pressing issue, or if you, if it does resonate, you just need more clarity, okay? So Aquarius, what is your love life? What's in store for you for 2000? In 18 February 2018 happy Valentine's Day to all of you okay Give me one second here just to try and get a little bit of a good shuffle my cards are getting a little used here <laughs> So we have the Queen of Cups with the King of Pentacles. Interesting. So Aquarius, what's coming through for you presently, male or female, is this Queen of Cups energy. So I feel like a lot of you are getting in touch with your emotions. Some of you may be dealing with an Earth sign, this King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, who is a benefit to you but also th they're in the challenge position um i feel like there's difficulty in being able to connect with them connect with this person male or female okay um and this could also be the opposite it could be you aquarius where you're having difficulty you're very focused on work uh, but you could be having a challenging situation with a water sign scorpio Cancer or Pisces. Okay, doesn't have to be those signs, but one person is very emotionally grounded and <clears throat> very intuitive and feeling deeply, uh, feeling things very deeply, really paying attention to the emotions. And the other person is being difficult, very focused on work, business schooling finances career now the root of the problem is the hermit so some of you could be dealing with a virgo but this is an energy of being withdrawn okay and i do feel like for those of you dealing with an earth sign there isn't there that energy of that person is in the month of february they will be i feel like they're just they're kind of thinking things over and it may have something to do with this past situation the ten of swords some type of a betrayal an ending to a situation an ending to a betrayal feeling stabbed in the back something from your past And also I'm getting the message that some of you are trying to figure out if you want to move forward in a relationship with a, an earth sign or this king of pentacles person because perhaps there was a betrayal in the past from them or uh, you're starting over with them now and it's just a little difficult getting uh, the energy to come out, the emotional connection to come forward with this person I feel like it's them uh, honestly I feel like there's a blockage that the chariots here and this card talks about movement and and the mindset the overall what's crowning this reading is this desire to move forward perhaps take a trip have vacation meet if you're long distance with this person to meet this person um, and 
trying to decide, I feel like, when I look at this card, because you see you've got, well, if you can see it, there's a white horse and a black horse. So trying to decide between either good and evil, right or wrong, um, looking for a way to, to, to choose a path, which is the right path for you, and, you know, that energy pulling through is this the way to go questioning I feel like you're questioning yourself you're questioning your beliefs you're questioning your victories your desires your truths I have the eight of Pentacles coming up in the near future so this card talks about putting in the work putting in the effort nose to the grindstone in this relationship and this is what this is how this energy will play out with this because I feel like what's going on is that this particular situation with this particular person needs extreme amount of effort in order for this to work and someone's contemplating whether or not this can be done making a decision thinking about things reflecting pulling back some of you may be apart from this person because of a past betrayal but still longing for them or there's just distance between you and a desire to connect a desire to move it forward I do feel like The energy for you and the other person is a desire to make it work. But this person here, this King of Pentacles, they're in, they're, I feel like they're good for you. They're very business oriented, business minded. They, if it's a female, this person comes across as maybe a bit more masculine at times or vice versa. Or if you're a homosexual relationship, either one. The energy is to get in touch with how you feel, how this person feels, and to actually s begin to think about, because the thought process is <clears throat> the contemplation that's happening here with the hermit, is how, how do we move this forward? What do we need to do? And I see that energy coming in, in January. I see a victory with effort being made here. The victory comes from the effort that's put in. Actually discussing, maybe making plans to meet, or discussing and thinking about weighing all the options and figuring out how to do that. So there, there could be um, travel the advice for you is the ten of pentacles so with that card there's safety and that's what you're looking for you're looking for safety and security that's your ultimate goal you're not you're not really the type of person um you could all uh, well let me say first you could also be expressing this pentacle energy because you're looking for security in this relationship and you know that the only way to have this is for the effort to be made so are you asking yourself do you need to make this effort with this person have you made this effort with this person are you willing to go a second round with them if this is someone from your past that's betrayed you Or is this someone new coming in for you? Because I feel like you are presenting with the Queen of Pen uh, the Queen of Cups energy. You're really in tune with how you're feeling. You're gentle. You're kind. You're warm. You're caring. But you're looking for security and safety. And the only way that you know for you to get that is to work hard at something. And I feel like 
you and the other person, whether this is someone new or this is your past returning, will have a victory as a second shot. You could be moving. There could be discussion about moving in with this person or they moving in with you. Um, you know, um, traveling to see each other, having to put in the effort to see each other through travel. But I feel like in February, you're really, uh, Aquarius is really paying attention now and really taking it seriously. Their hearts, you're taking your heart seriously now. You're, you know, you're wondering you're asking yourself, can this work? Or even if you're presenting with the energy of the King of Pentacles and you're dealing with a water sign, you know, uh, you're thinking about this solidarity of the relationship because this person's more emotional. But you are, you are contemplating the foundation you're contemplating the the ground that it stands on and if it can now how the other person is viewing this situation they're positive about this i feel like they have high value on you the page of pentacles here you know they are celebrating they are trying to also manipulate the situation to make it come forward in a um in a practical way even though they could be presenting as the Queen of Cups and they are emotionally in touch <coughs> with what's going on with them. And they're, they're viewing you also. There could be messages back and forth between the two of you, which could be based on business or finances, most likely. It could be a work connection. But I feel like you know, it's something that they value. They, they place high value on you. Absolutely, Aquarius. And, and there's a fear of the situation ending within you. But you're hoping that it won't. There's something about the two of you or this other person I feel like whatever may have happened in the past, whatever betrayal, <coughs> excuse me, even if you had a betrayal from someone else and you're just done with it, if this is someone new coming in for you, this person's ready to put in the work and the effort. They're ready for it. They're ready for a new beginning, a relationship. They're, they're ready to move in your direction. I see them here with the Page of Pentacles. There will be oops, messages coming out, coming from them during the month of February that, you know, they want to make this work. They place high value on you. There could be an offer of some sort also, an offer of money or to pay for something and an offer of love. The Knight of Cups. Okay, so I think that's beautiful. There could be an offer to, for a trip or to go somewhere to meet someone, to meet them, they to come see you. For truly making the effort. I really feel that's probably the overall energy for this reading. Now, the outcome position strength awesome this bond that you have with this person as a second go around again on oh, the lovers this is a good union all right that wanted to flip out but it didn't and then it did and then it didn't so i'm not going to take it this is a strong union with this person this is both of you making the decision to to, to have a relationship to be together so whatever trouble that you may have had in the past, that betrayal or whatever hurt or pain you felt, that's over. That's what the 10 is. You've hit the bottom.
and you're ready to move forward in your life now. Your overall energy is give the relationship a chance, work on your partnership. And that's what I was saying with the Eight of Pentacles here. This is all about working on this relationship to be victorious in it. Both of you, I see that. So I see, am I seeing like a reconciliation? Not necessarily because I don't feel like someone ever really left your heart. Uh, and I don't feel like they ever left your heart. I'm not 100% sure what the betrayal or the Ten of Swords energy could be coming from. I feel like you would know that. And I'll let you uh, figure that one out. But I do see sometime in February a relationship forming um, in, a, in a loving, romantic way. Okay, Aquarius, so positive reading. I hope that you enjoyed this reading. Please do contact me for a personal private reading. Um, I My bookings are, I have a lot of uh, openings right now, so definitely take advantage of that if you can. And uh, I will see you in March. All right, take care.